Bonjour à tous, hi everyone, and welcome to Learn French with Vincent. And this is Unité 2, Leçon H. And in this lesson, we'll discover la forme négative. So if you want to say that you are not blah blah blah, doing something, or so the negative form in French. And so the negative form in French is composed of two elements. The first one is ne, and then you get your verb, and right after your verb, you will have to put this pas. Okay, so first ne, then the verb, and after that pas. Okay, we write it P-A-S, okay, but as usual, final S is not pronounced, so it's pas. Okay, remember one thing, in some cases, we will have verbs starting whether with a vowel or then with H, 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 plus a vowel, and in French, H is not pronounced, okay, so for these verbs, E will have to disappear, and it will be written like that, N. Okay, then will come the verb, and after that, doesn't change, it will be pas. Alright, so let's see a few examples now. So for ne, pas, so if you get a sentence like il parle avec moi, so il parle, he is talking, avec, with, moi, me. Okay, remember this moi. Uh, we introduced that uh, in this unit and it was a pronoun tonique, okay? Il parle avec moi. So if you want to put the negative form of this sentence, so remember, first part ne, so before the verb, then you put your verb, parle, basically you don't change it, just put it there, parle, and after that you put the second part, pas, okay? Then you get the sentence, il ne Parle pas avec moi. And that's it. You've got your negative sentence here. Okay? Let's see now how it will go with an apostrophe pas. Okay? So, nous allons en France. Okay? So, in that case, if you look, you've got the verb aller. Aller means to go. Okay? Nous allons. Nous allons. We are going, okay, en France, to France. Here, first letter is A. Okay, remember the rule. If it's not with a vowel, like here, it is the case, you will have to drop and take away this E form. So that's the reason why we've got this N apostrophe like that. N'allons. Nous n'allons. And then you don't really need to think. You just put this pas after the verb, en France. Nous n'allons pas en France. Nous n'allons pas en France. And that's it. Okay, second example here. It's with the verb habiter. Habiter is to leave. You know, when you, you introduce the place where you, where you live. Okay, and then here, I took this example or this verb just because, of course, it's starting with H, but as I said, you don't pronounce it. So the first sound you hear here is the vowel. And that's enough just to drop and to take away this E. Uh. So you will basically make it like in this example. You will put this N apostrophe. Elle n'habite pas dans cette maison. So elle habite, she lives or she is living, dans in this house. Elle habite dans cette maison. And then neg negative form. Elle n'habite pas. Dans cette maison. I hope it was clear. It was short, but really important. Uh, so it was uh, Unité de Leçon H. You can find Leçon I at the following address here. Okay. And then the website is here. Okay. Have a great day. Bye-bye.